as for the DH, I have a long history with it. Night, I was in New York in December of 1972. You voted for it, right? I you, voted. The only yeah. thing of Charlie Finley's I ever voted for. I, no I, kidding. Oh, wow. God. I, and I, it pained me to vote for that oh. because it was <laughs> Finley's idea. Yeah, I, I but anyway, uh, we did because the American League, uh, uh, John Fetzer, who was my mentor in baseball, owned the Detroit Tigers, convinced me that it's something we ought to do, and even though it was Charlie Finley. Uh, but what, what I would say to you about that is that the American League did need more offense, and it's worked in the American League. I love the National League, too, and I love the way they play baseball. Today. What I have said, we've now done it 41 years. The National League clubs and fans hate it. The American League clubs and fans love it. Um, Bill Giles, who's the chairman of the, of the Phillies, who's not a controversial, often says to me, I like the country. It's good for the game. People debate it. And I agree with it. What I have always said and what I would say to you here today is that it's going to take some kind of catalytic event. And what I mean by that, if someday, well in the future, if you go to overall geographical realignment or something like that where you'd have to change a lot of things, then maybe they'll consider. But right at the moment, I, I don't think the game gets hurt. So a lot of people that. argue that the NL is going to go to the DH in the foreseeable future. You don't see that no. on the horizon? No. You don't? No. And I'm telling you, they're not. All right. That's a good one. All right, I learned something.